Yeah. Many people have been messaging me concerning that fruits of that fruits of that fruits of fruits. Actually, the recent update about that fruits of is on. You know, before we always add it as extension, like a uh, private extension. Uh, yeah. So it's the same method. It is working uh, same way, but it's in a new dimension. You know, before we make it so switch omega extension. Input the socks and port, we put everything there and it starts working. But it's different now. Now, how do we get started? For now, this is what you need to do. You need to go to your dashfulsocks.net. If you don't have any money on it, uh, if you don't have any subscription plans on it, uh, be prepared to have subscription plan on it. So, and if you already have it, there is no problem. This method is working for touch. Subs and digital subs because they have same data, they have same website interface. Even to me, I believe in my mind that it is supported by two persons. But Thai subs is uh, uh, is quite expensive, you know. It's quite expensive than digital subs, like two or three dollar difference. So I've already logged in, I've already subscribed. But for you, just make sure you create account. You click on buy socks. You know how to do that. Buy socks and the subscription plan you are capable of, uh, that you are capable of. That's what you need to be. That's what you really need to do. So guys, now this is what you need to do. You just click on daily fifty for thirty days, which is eight dollar. I'm very okay with this. Click on select payment, and if you are using Bitcoin, Litecoin, USDT, and others, but for me, I prefer Litecoin. So if I get my USDT coin on. I will just convert it to Litecoin so that I can top it up here. And this is it. You copy this address, you copy this address, you paste it there. That's number one. And make sure you set this exact amount. Now, when you want to send this thing, you know this is 0 0.0805 is don't do it like that because at times because of the uh, the coin is not stable, it can be like 581. Uh, 0 0.0805815582 and they will say you should go and pay that 0 0.000001 which is a big problem uh, of which before you can set such out especially on USDT minimum is like four dollar so you waste another four dollars so I always do it like this 0 0.08059 just make sure you add one digit to this five nine or if you want to give them money you can do 0 0.80 Six zero but five nine is okay and make sure you complete the transactions within one hour 59 minutes which is one hour let's say 30 minutes according to you so once you get that done you will be credited and you will have access to it now with all this now will you believe that if you go and ask switch your mega extension it's not going to work it's not going to work at all if you come here now you had switch mega you know you had it it's not going to it's not going to work so this is what you really need to do guys you need to come here on that socks here they did something here they did something here that you need to uh, that you need to do you click on this soft client you know soft client once you click on it like this it takes you to where it is called dashusocks.net slash tools now you now need an extension called foxy proxy that's all you need to do so let me remove this. Let me remove all this. So you go to you just click on Foxy Proxy Extension. That's all you need to do. Foxy Proxy Extension. Come it like this. Foxy Proxy Extension. I'm going to disconnect all this US, all this thing, all this web share proxy, everything. So this is uh, we have to pass the capture, you know them. You have to pass it. So Foxy Proxy, this is it. It's going to show now. Uh, you find this extension on Google, you know. Now. Yeah. So guys, this is the Foxy Proxy extension. I've disconnected the VPN, the web share, uh, web share proxy. I disconnect everything. So I'm going to add this to Brave. I want to add this to Brave. Now, so the network is 
Il nous reste du choix. <laughs> so guys, let me, before the network load, I want to show you my current uh, IP now, you know. I uh, want to check our current IP, which is war.net, we get that on war.net, this is loading. The network is going in and going out. So add to brief. So I'm going to review my, you see that it's Nigerian, something like that. You know one thing is that we are using proxy to create our accounts. Because it is far, far better than VPN. You know, VPN deals with anonymity. Anytime Fiverr receives a new application, they know that it is one from this set of people. You know, those set of people, people like me, people like you. So that's why it is, uh, that's why they are blocking account, restricting account, because they don't want their platform to be vaccinated and creating account. Is our own job. Having multiple accounts is our own dream. So to make everything work together, we have to follow some strategy. So this is what we need to do. The extension is ready. This one is loading. You know the IP is 197.210.79.97. Now, so let me close this extension of it. And I need to come back here again. Now you see something there. They say you should download it. If you want to use clients, please turn off your antivirus. Yeah, you download this thing. Why? It is it is what you are going to be using to be managing the proxy with the extension. Are you getting it now? With the mic, with the Chrome profile. You know this is the Chrome profile we are using. This is the Chrome profile we are trying to use here on this Chrome. That's what we are using. So guys, it is very very important to have our folks activated but the game has changed so once you click on this you download this once you download it you install it but one thing is that of your uh, what do you call this thing of your um antivirus and there's one thing here let me check here uh or oh, window security yes make sure you have it too of everything because it will not uh i mean let me say they will not allow it because there are many so guys once downloaded so once it is downloaded you are going to see something like this you see something like this here socks five clients and you run it if it's somebody like me you have to pin it to your tab pin to tax bar you know you pin it to tax bar in case of next time just pin it like that so this is what we are going to do now that the proxy is added you pin it like this once you pin it like this you see this one shows abuja nigeria yes this is abuja nigeria that is my current ip address is abuja nigeria now what i need to do now is that i need to now go to this let me let me close this because of new people let me close it so you click on this proxy proxy here you click on you see something disable here that means if you want to disable the proxy you click on options immediately you click on options you click on proxies are you getting it now you click on options you click on proxy you now click something here called add you see something here click on add immediately you click on that add everything is simple on this put anything put any name let's say we put linear on it you know, uh, the actual socks give us socks five, so you, you click on socks five here. So, what you need to do, all, all these uh, country, city, you are less concerned about that. 
Now, your host name, you now go to your dietary source. So, we come to dietary source here. You see something here? Uh, Sox 5 pot, IP plants, this nice, this nice. Our host name, you copy this. 127.0.01, control C it like this. And you come back here. You come back here. You paste it here like this. Host name 127.0.01. And you come back here again. You click on this 6969. You give it to the port. So you put on port. You see it like this. You now click on you see what I did. What I did. I put Spilonia Sox 5. 127.07.6969. You click on save. So if I'm someone like you, since you know that you have to all this is not hard to put on the uh, on our head. So what we need to do is that anytime you want to use it, you create a new tab. You do this, you do that. All you need to do is to the host name 127.0.0.1 port 6969. You leave it like that and you click on save. Immediately you click on save like this. This is what you now need to do. You know, this is already saved. You now click on your extension at the top here. You see Spilonia here now. This is what you need to do. You know, my current IP is Abuja, Nigeria. You now click here like this. Click on let me close this not needed again. So here you click here again. You now click on this is nice is nice. Are you getting it now? So that is our manager. You click on it like this. Immediately you click on it. You now come back to your what you download, which is soft socks five client. You click on it here like this. You now need to log in. You want to log in, you know. I want to log in. You use your die full socks. You use your die full socks to log in, you know. You use it to log in all your tie socks. You use it to log in everything. So you can click remember me. So already log in now. Then I say I want to use United States. This is what I need to do. United States. This is what I need to do. And the region. Uh, maybe I want to use California. You know, I want to use California. The cities in California. Let's say I want to use. Um, so California is very big like this. Let's say I want to do Sacramento. So the blacklist, I don't want blacklist IP. You click on no. So no is okay. You now click on search source. Immediately you click on search source. These are the available ones that are not blacklisted. Now, you know before we always copy this thing. So immediately you click on this. You click on it like you want to open it like this. It is connected. You see something here, it shows that use today, credit remaining. Use today is now one. You see it like this now. So, what you need to do now is that this is connected. So, you need to go to word.net here. Yeah. So, we want to check it on word.net. We have already connected to the socks here. We have connected, we have activated our pools. And this is our manager here. So, this is what we need to do. So, it's loading. It's loaded, and this thing is pretty cool. What I notice is that it's always longer. You know, before when we are using it on Switch Omega, it always work like ten minutes. Even some, you know, what twenty minutes, thirty minutes. But with their new updates, it is working cool. It is working well. Like I really enjoy it. So let me wait. Let wait because of the if Word.net is not loading. So let's go to IP two location. IP2 location so that to check our location. That one is also working well. It is working well, you know. So let's check. Now, so let me click here like this. This is my IP2 location. I want to check the location. So, Word.net is sleeping. We don't know why Word.net is kindly sleeping. But let's check this one. Now, so because of the time is going already. So let's say you use this one, you want to use this one again. Immediately you click on it, it's going to open it and it will connect automatically. That's just how it is working. If the journey is there, but let me check if they have included uh, the best country in the whole world. You know, you know it. Oh, Nigeria is even there, good. So you don't have problem of Nigerian proxy again, thank God. Nigeria is now there. You can use Nigerian, you can use South Africa country, you can, you know. So we we thank God, we appreciate them, you know. So this is our new IP.
209.184 compared to this 197 again. So uh, 209.184.138.53, .13, everything is working well. But I want you to show the location so that because some people will be like, oh, well, my own is not showing location, is this, is that. You know, it's not easy to always do research, you know. Every day they are updating, they are updating, upgrading new things. That's why the Fiverr mentorship class is very important because there are some updates I will be dropping there, which is not going to be on YouTube. But for the, because of this, I'm going to put this on YouTube because it's a general training, you know. It's a something general. So we are trying to check. We are trying to look up. We are trying to look up. For me, I don't know why this thing will do. But this is 209.184.138.35. It is very fast, though. It's because of the network here. It's fucking bad, you know. It's bad. It's not good at all. It's not good at all. But let me try my location. I just want you to see the location. Like, like you see it by yourself like this. That's what I'm trying to. Uh, that's what I'm trying to do. You just I want you to see the location. My location, you see it like yeah, you from Abuja, you have teleported to uh, you don't teleport to uh, see California, Los Angeles City. It shows we are in Los Angeles. That's why policy is good. If you are dreaming to travel to abroad, if you instead of you paying for visa, paying for international passport. If there are problems like that, all you need is to just connect your policy. You can reach there. You can reach there, you know. It is not hard at all. In a trip of an eye, you reach any Canada locations anywhere in the world. Now, if you now been using it and you see that it's not working again, you can change it. Immediately you change it here. If I click on this one now, everything will change automatically. If I click on this one, so that means you need to be mindful. If you click here now, that means you have changed the IP. Thank you all. Stay tuned, comment, and share. I love you all. More bits will be dropped. We always work very well because of you guys. We are working hard, getting things done. If this is the IP issue, 209.184. And the one it show here is also 209.184. Oh, enjoy. Enjoy, guys. Our TikTok class will soon, be, will soon start. I am preparing one big course for you that is going to be free for everyone. So if you want to join mentorship, hard class, LLC, Shopify, you are free to join. Thank you, everyone.